I'm going to say something very controversial. I hate traveling. I'm super tall, so planes are really uncomfortable and generally I just don't like making plans, but last year I got asked to go to France and give a talk at a conference. My wife loves traveling, so guess what happened? They put us up in these rooms in this little village on top of the hill, and I was with Vincent de Bauer. I love Vincent. He's fearless with the brush, and fearless in all things, actually. He's super nice. He dropped me a page in my sketchbook. Such a sweetheart. I love the way he rotates the brush. It's really wild to see. After the conference, we headed to Paris, and I got to meet Julien Priez. Julien is actually good friends with Vincent, and I just love his work so much. It was a long flight home, so 12 more hours and a little tiny plane. Then Jen Ramirez invited me to the La Trastica conference in Guadalajara. I knew the rules at this point, so we packed up the family again. Julianne was invited as well, and we got to share a classroom for a couple days. I was lucky to spend some quality time with his amazing sketchbooks. And Jen is another guy that is pretty fun to watch with a brush. The way he handles the pressure and the rotation makes it look so easy, but you know it's years of practice to get to that point. They'd have these little sessions at the conference where the calligraphers show off, and a student from the workshop I was teaching showed me how you can rotate the brush in this certain way to create italics. Of course, I couldn't do it at all, which was kind of embarrassing, but I knew I wanted to practice with the brush as soon as I got home. As conference season was coming to an end, I was just totally enamored with the work of all my friends, and the flat brush just seemed like the tool for expressing some of the things that I'd learned. So I started practicing, but it's so hard. Swear is the response. Type design is hard too, but more in a, oh, this project is gonna take forever kind of way. I named Swear after my frustration with calligraphy. Anyone who's tried to handle a flat brush knows how frustrating it can be. But just because something is difficult, maybe doesn't make it bad. Traveling can be really frustrating. Planes and airports and making plans is all super frustrating. But when I think about my friends and good times that we got to share and a lot of their ideas that I can steal and put into my typefaces, I think it's definitely worth it in the end.